Presenting Worst Actress, please welcome to our stage a 2016 GOP presidential candidate and Worst Supporting Actor Razzie winner for a cameo as himself in Bo Derrick's dog, Ghosts Can't Do It, <laughs> Donald Trump. Everybody, all right. They were horrible. You're fired. Hello, everybody. I'm Donald Trump. Please sit out. Sit, sit, sit. First off, I can't believe you had Obama here. All right. He's absolutely horrible. He didn't win a Razzie. I want a Razzie. I'm a winner. I'm winning everywhere. I'm doing fantastic. Yeah, that guy. I'm always winning. I'm always winning. <laughs> now listen, I've been drawing huge crowds wherever I go, and tonight is no exception. This is incredible. There's about 50,000 people here. <laughs> and since we are here in Los Angeles, I have a very, very, very important question. By a round of applause, who here is Mexican? <laughs> hear that? Press, did you see that? You see that? They love me. The Mexican people love me. I hope you got that. And I love the Mexican people. They're fantastic people. I love Mexican culture. I love chimichangas, quesadillas, and Oompa Loompas. They're fantastic. And not only do I love the Mexican people, I love, love, love women. I cherish women. I absolutely do. They're fantastic. I married three of them. <laughs> and who better than me to give out the award for Worst Actress of the Year? Are you guys ready? Are you set for this? This is, this is going to be fantastic. It's going to be absolutely amazing. All right, so first, Catherine Hagel for Home Sweet Hell, all right? Personally, I don't see what's so disgusting. She's blonde, she's stupid, has a fantastic ass, really an amazing ass, really. She looks like my daughter, frankly, she really does. A monstrous Martha Stewart clone who seems woefully past her expiration date. Ben Kinnisberg, New York Times. Very good, all right, thanks guys. All right. Next, Dakota Johnson. By the way, there's a stupid, stupid name, Dakota. North Dakota, South Dakota, doesn't matter. This is for 50 Shades of Grey. You know what, I actually liked her mom before her mom got old, you know. <laughs> yeah, well, you know what I say, 44 and out the door, I'm sorry, you know. But it's time to go, it's time to go. Playing a woman whose sexual awakening is meant to be extremely erotic, the adjectives most often used in reviews were vanilla, vanilla and beige. beige. Mm. <laughs> All right, next, Melia Kunis, and technically, she's in and as Juniper Ascending. <laughs> she was okay before she got pregnant, now she's kind of, you know, loose skin. Um, <laughs> She was really, really good in Black Swan in that lesbian scene. That was hot. I love, love lesbians. They're fantastic. She deserves a Razzie for the soon-to-be classic scene in which she shoots down Red Means feet to ruler by screaming, I'm not your damn mother. Peter Travers, Rolling Stone. Good. All right, next up, Jennifer Lopez for messing around with the boy next door. And you know how I feel about immigrants. <laughs> and I'm gonna throw J-Lo over the wall back into Mexico <laughs> on the first day that I'm president. And I'm gonna get the Mexican people to pay for it. <laughs> and I know what you're thinking, J-Lo's from Puerto Rico. Too bad she's going back to Mexico. <laughs> she's got a big ass too, which I don't like. Some of the most unconvincing acting this side of a soup commercial. <laughs> James Baraldolini, realnews.com.
Thank you. All right, finally, Gwyneth Paltrow for even considering Mordecai. She looks like she goes to the bathroom a lot, a real lot. She's just like a bag of bones. Very, very unattractive. I know attractive women. I own two beauty pageants. She's not one of them. Don't be tiresome, Paltrow tells Depp at one point. I myself tempted to yell the same thing at the screen. <laughs> Stephen Whitty, NewJersey.com. Good, all right. Where's the envelope? Come on, let's go. I'm very, very busy. Come on. All right. Oh my God, what the hell is this? <laughs> Jesus. You're horrible, you're late, you're unattractive. You know what, get out of here, you're fired. Come on, let's go. Hit it, hit it, hit it. What are you... <laughs> easy, not the, not the hair, not the hair. Easy, easy, take it. Guys, where's my guard? Can we get the guards here? Can we get the guards here? Let me out of here. All right, get her out of here. That was the worst excuse for Caitlyn Jenner I've ever seen. All right. And the winner for worst, oh, calm down, like you didn't think of it first. Worst Actress 2016 here at the Razzies, Dakota Johnson, 50 Shades of Grey. If she isn't here, where is she? Steve Zaragoza here, your roving Razzies reporter. I paid a cop 20 bucks to give me some software that'll help me track Dakota Johnson directly to where she is via her cell phone. And if my calculations are correct, she should be right across the street there. Uh, congratulations. Listen, I almost forgot, March 1st, Super Tuesday, Trump 2016. Make sure you vote.